Two men charged in the murder of a Johnson County couple are now in the process of hiring lawyers. Today in court, a judge appointed a temporary public defender for Jamie Lynn Curd until he can hire his own attorney. Marvin Potter Jr. is in the process of hiring his own lawyer. And the two men are charged with first-degree murder in the deaths of Billie Jean Hayworth and Curd's cousin Billy Payne at the couple's home outside Mountain City, Tennessee. A family friend found Payne and Hayworth's baby unharmed in his mother's arms at the crime scene. The TBI said the victims had a history with the Potter family. Investigators said the pair filed a harassment complaint against Potter's daughter last year, sparking a feud between the families that resulted in murder. The 11 Connects Nate Morbido was in the courtroom for today's arraignment in Mountain City. Nate, what decision did the judge make concerning what I know is a big issue in the community, bond for Curd and Potter? Josh, right now, Marvin Potter's bond remains set at $200,000 per count. The judge held off on any decision about that bond. I'll explain why in a minute. But the judge did increase the bond of Jamie Curd. Curd is the cousin of Billy Payne, one of the victims in this case. Pay, uh, Curd, rather, was previously held also at $200,000 bond per count. The DA's office says that is a high bond, but to make sure he didn't get out of jail and hurt someone, they asked the judge to up that dollar amount, which he did. He is now being held on $750,000 per count, which prosecutors say is important, considering they have the option to seek the death penalty in this case. The fact that um, one of the victims was related to him shows his attitude towards family. And the fact that this is potentially a capital offense, that he could get the death penalty, um, we feel that that really affects his um, flight risk, the fact that he may take off. As we said, Marvin Potter is still trying to hire an attorney, so the judge will not make a decision about his bond until next week when he appears in court on Wednesday for a bond hearing. We mentioned yesterday about Potter's daughter. She was in court today as an observer, although she has not been charged with any crime at this point. Prosecutors say she is at the center of this investigation. They say she is the common link to all of the parties involved. Not only is she Potter's daughter, she's also, according to prosecutors, formally the girlfriend of Kurt. She was also the defendant in a harassment case last year that was dismissed in that case, which involved some phone messages and some internet postings. According to investigators, the victims in this case testified against her. I spoke with the mother of Billy Payne after court today, Josh. She told me all they want is for justice for these two people. They continue to ask for everyone's prayers. All right, 11 Connects, Nate Morbido reporting live for us this evening in Mountain City, Tennessee. Nate, thank you very much. We appreciate it.